How are small businesses moving forward after the pandemic? A new report presents the hurdles small businesses overcame and business strategies that are worth adopting in 2021. So at Hello Alice, we really believe in strong data sets. And with our 2020 impact report, we surveyed over 200,000 small business owners in every industry and in all 50 states. So that allowed us to see barriers and opportunities for each type of business owners. What the data has shown us is that the small businesses that have already started pivoting are the ones who are already starting to emerge out of this crisis. This is going to be the most unknown market we've ever been in. Customer behavior is going to be very different. How we use all things e-commerce, very different. So whatever you think your business plan is, it needs to have a flexibility to it so you can constantly assess and pivot. One thing in our data that surprised folks is the last chunk of money between doors closing or staying open is actually tends to be quite small. Where the rubber hits the road on that is final payment. So it might be rent, it might be the final tax bill. So what does that mean for you as a small business owner? Apply, apply, apply. What we saw in the data is owners are not applying for PPP round two. They're not applying for private grants. There's a lot of fatigue there because they hear no too often, particularly women and people of color. However, we have to keep applying. We have to keep diversifying that funding. It is critical. We found in the data that businesses with really strong teams had more success than those without. And I know that seems quite obvious. However, generally talent is your largest line item. It's also the fastest, easiest way to cut. If you're going through just like we did or are as a business, the toughest time of your life, having talent around the table that you trust has your back, but most of all has differing opinions on how you can stretch, how you can squeeze money, how you can get better customer acquisition and make it through something like this. Those are really some of the companies that ended up making it through. What surprised me the most from the data is how much small business owners need each other. 75% of small business owners that engaged in some kind of peer network were more successful. We saw just an unbelievable upswell of small business owners joining digital networks, even when they're closing, trying to ensure their fellow small business owners stay open. Seeing both through the data and the stories that kind of web to help each other, I thought was very special and important. We had small business owners that unfortunately had to close or go bankrupt who are already planning on a new business. And that is the entrepreneurial spirit. And that's why we all need to band together and ensure that we're supporting each other, not just where we were, but let's make the new normal better than it was. Please leave a comment. I also love your ideas on how we can do a better job helping others. So we're here for you. GoDaddy is having conversations with experts to help entrepreneurs everywhere. Subscribe and stay tuned for upcoming videos. Feel free to comment below and let us know what topics you would like to hear about next.